Mkosi keleili Africa One of the most beautiful national anthems in the world South Africa I never knew a day would come I'll be hugging and laughing with my brothers and sisters from South Africa the home of Madiba Hi Nelson Odessa South Mandela Mandela I know most of you don't even want to see any videos about South Africa because when you hear the name South Africa first thing that comes into your mind is Xenophobia. Xenophobia. Xenophobia violence seems to be spreading. The incident was just one of the 139 documented shock meetings in South Africa in 2018 motivated by xenophobia. But remember, in every country, there is positive and negative. South Africa is not what you think. Think. South Africa is a wonderful country. South Africa is a country of Ubuntu. South Africa is a country where people are united. South Africa is not what people make it out to be. We love each other. We are a welcoming country. We love you. I am Maya. We accept everyone for who they are with their own individual personality and different backgrounds but at the end of the day we all combine and we're united and we all love each other you're free to be who you are it didn't start easy it took a lot of blood sweat and tears from people like nelson mandela for us to reach a point that we are at as a country whereby we have freedom of expression and we have freedom to be who we genuinely are and live the lives that we choose to live given the opportunity brothers and sisters welcome home welcome to south africa Saubon, uh, first impression about South Africa, this country is super developed. Like I was so shocked when I got here because everything in here is world class, world class infrastructure. I mean, South Africa is super developed. Look at the buildings behind me. The roads in here are super high class. You got pedestrian walk. I mean, the pedestrian walk in South Africa even looks like a bridge. Oh my goodness, there's traffic lights inside. I mean, I feel like South Africa is well organized. And um, you know what? I don't even know what to say. All I can tell you is that South Africa is on another level. level. Ah, thank, thank you. Hey guys, my name is Toby, Toby Rose, Toby Gam Tembu. I'm from Johannesburg, South Africa. And if you want to come to this amazing city, here are a few things that you should know about my city. Firstly, it is the city of gold, the city of opportunity. And if you are a real hustler, there is no way else that you will know how to hustle and bustle than in Johannesburg. Secondly, the colors, the culture, the melting pots of people from everywhere within Africa is right here in South Africa. If you didn't know that, we have people from everywhere. Number three is our music. Okay, if you come here, you need to come to the clubs, you need to go to the Shabins, you need to go where the music is from. Shoma Josie is from here, if you do not know. So yeah, come here for the music. Number four is, I guess, our art and creativity. We are known to be creative beings in terms of music, art, fashion, street art, street fashion, everything. We are literally known for that. We also do have the tallest building in Africa and we have amazing malls if you do love spending money here. But we also have 11 different languages that are all the way from South Africa. So if you come here, you need to know a little bit of Zulu, a little bit of Kosa, a little bit of Swati. Okay, that's what Swati like. But hey, you gotta know a little bit of everything and then you will know that you are a true Joe Burger. You do not speak one language here, we speak everything. Okay, shut You've got a lot of um, buildings that came up from the 1900s to what it is now. So this is um, the old uh, Johannesburg uh, city center, the center of Johannesburg. This is where after the gold rush in the 1900s, pre um, precisely 1913, that's when a lot of migrants moved to come and look for work, 
and, and start working in the city center as this city started to come up. It's really improved right now, like you can see in terms of cleanliness, new buildings coming up, some buildings are being renovated, um, new building projects that are taking place. So it's, 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 it's really, really beautiful. Welcome to Maboneng, which means the place of light. This is a rejuvenated area in the city of Johannesburg where a lot of people come for the markets, for the music, for the vibe and the energy of the city. Um, Johannesburg is filled with so much amazing stuff, guys. We have uh, an amazing transport system, world-class infrastructure. Um, we've got the Hau train, which is like one of the most amazing and fastest trains in Africa. We've got fashion. Uh, we've got one of the most amazing rooftop venues um, where you can see the views of the city. And we just have such interesting um, people filled with so much personality. Uh, Joburg is loud and vibrant and you should really um, explore it. Did you know that the most expensive square mile in Africa is here in Johannesburg? Yes, this is the most expensive square mile of city in Africa. Right, right here in Santon City, we've got the tallest building in Africa right now. It's got a penthouse apartment, it's got a school inside, it's got a lifestyle center. Everything around us right now, you are surrounded by the most beautiful buildings, high-tech buildings with the latest technology right now in Santon. You know what? South Africa is really making me look like a village boy, man, because I cannot keep my neck still. I keep on looking left, right, center. But one thing I've noticed in this country is very greenish. They plant trees everywhere. Everything is super organized. I mean, like, just look at This is for bicycle. South Africa is just too beautiful, man. I mean, like, I feel like using the word beautiful is even an understatement for a beautiful country like this. No, I mean, like I said, it's on another level. Let's keep it that way. <laughs> a lot of stories about this country I didn't even want to come but I still had to come to tell the positive stories about this beautiful country I am here my experience here is different from the stories that I had and definitely you can also come here and your story might be different from mine let's come together and tell our own story different countries one Africa. If today's your first time on my channel, don't forget to like this video, share to a friend, subscribe to support the movement. It's all about South Africa to the world. I am Maya. Peace out.